Hello guys, welcome back to some more God of War. In last episode we started making our way out of Helheim and we saw plenty of Helheim illusions while trying to escape Helheim. Atreus did see some of them but luckily he didn't pay too much attention. One of them was Kratos beating the crap out of Zeus. But I don't think Apeus thankfully didn't pay too much attention to it due to the dangerous situation we were on that ship. If you remember from the last episode. And this episode now we're now going to finally make our way out of Helheim. I think with the illusions we saw, I think we've been in Helheim long enough. If we stay around here too long, Atreus is going to see something that we do not want him to see. Let's just see what's in this room quickly. It looks like a chest. Can I hope I can open it? This is where Odin brought all his best booze about Jotunheim. Fair enough. Okay, let's open up this chest and see what's inside. What is this? Eye of the Outer Realm. Epic enchantment. Bonus to all stats. Cool. Very nice. Yep, certainly do with that. It's a good job I came in this room. Oh, we got one of these doors again. We'll have to use that thing we found many episodes ago. I remember this. Hopefully there's only about three or four of them I need to find. There's one. Where's the next one? Oh, no, not there. No, where is it? There we are. There's only two of them? Okay, fair enough. I thought there'd be more than that. This is Odin's. I'd recognize his atrocious taste anywhere. Hmm, do you? I'll try to smash things around, see if I can get more hack silver for it. I need to buy my when we next see one of the dwarfs, I need to buy myself a resurrection stone. It's the missing panel about here. Odin must have stolen it. But why? He always has his reasons. Might I have a look? Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? I haven't the foggiest. Isn't that unexpected? Head. Look, clearly that's tear. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. What are those runes in the corner? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. They mean... War. Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose, ho ho ho, I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Ed? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. He knew there was a clue in here, but we're the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. That symbol on the temple door. It's a bunch of rooms together. Complete escape from Helheim. Unity. We're not out of Helheim yet. Although we will be in a few moments. So we need to find the realm travel back to Midgard. So we now need to find another way to Jotunheim. Luckily we have another idea to get Jotunheim. We need to find a key. And to find a key we need to go to one of the dwarfs. Brock or Sindri. I don't care which one it is, as long as it's one of the dwarves so he can get a key. Boy. Before. When you. Saw. I didn't see anything. You did not see me with someone. An old man. What old man? Can we go? Yes. Very well. 
He doesn't remember it? That is shocking. Maybe he does remember it. Perhaps he just doesn't want to talk about it. Okay. Fair enough. I'm not going to question it. I think it'd be handy if... If Atreus does remember it, I think it'd best if we kept it that way. For obvious reasons. So now, what we'll do now is go find one of the dwarves. I don't care which one, out of Brock or Sindri, as long as we have a dwarf to find the key. If I had to pick one of them, I think I'd probably go Brock. But I don't really care which one I go for. As long as I can make a key for us, that's all that matters. Okay, travel to Midgard, just press it. the triangle button. Let's head back to Midgard. Yeah, I'm glad we're out of Helheim, though. That place is rough. Why did you not tell us Balder is the son of Freya? He is. It's shocking every time I hear it, and yet obviously I know it. But when I think about Balder and Freya, I... Ymir? Yes, lad. <laughs> Freya. How's that, brother? Ben, tell me Balder's vulnerability. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Wait. What is happening? He is bewitched not to speak of what he knows. I am? I am! Oh, that's it precisely! I wonder how long that's been so. Since she had my head at her mercy. Back when I figured out Baldur's weakness. I'm here! Yes, lad? You just said you figured out Baldur's weakness. Did I? But Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. <sighs> you know, no. This means there is a way. If he troubles us again, we will find it. Yes, everyone has a weakness. Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war of which I'm a master at shaping? No? Then forget it. Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo -gaw, I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so... Delicate and ladylike. Then shingle it. Pattern weld the item with scap slag. Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Shut your mouth. Is that... Where did you... I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't just stand there. Hey, let's do this. What? You? You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. Oh, wa watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? You don't need to. I triple quenched it with Drago. See how inventive and sanitary. You clever little beaver. Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah. Here it is. Nope. Don't forget this. Downright unsettling. It's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brain looks different. Impressive, but reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weak. I like the new one better. Don't you? We have work to do. No. Oh, Kratos, oh, she needs to be more cheery, man. That was such a sweet moment until you ruined it. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly upgrade my Blades of Chaos quickly because I found a new item in the last episode. Was it the last episode, the episode before that, I believe it was? We now got some more upgrades for the Blades of Chaos. I'm definitely going to need them. Okay, I'm going to see if I can upgrade the bow quickly. No, I don't think... The axe, maybe? Nope. Just having a quick 
Oh, actually. Reduce turns per hour recharge time. Yes, we'll do that. Most definitely. Can I do it again? Yes, I can. Wow. Oh, shit. I think I've, I almost forgot. I've upgraded to a max maximum, but I, what I think I forgot to do was find some resurrection stones. Oh, actually, I can get one. Small amount of health, a large amount of health. Uh, yeah, we'll go for this one. Okay, so I could still can still get resurrection stone. Nice. Yeah, that will do. Yes, that worked out. Okay, before we go any further, let's quickly upgrade some skills. Where are my blades? Here they are. The spear of chaos has created a minor fire explosion on contact, inflicting burn damage. Yes, please, we'll go for that. I hold R2 to charge the blades of chaos even further and release a powerful elemental slash inflicting massive burn damage in a wide area. Yep. What's this one? This knife offers a momentarily after any blades of chaos attack. Once you start, bloody blade blow. Yep, we'll go for that as well. Very nice. What's this one? Shock dogs are chained to a greater number of enemies. Yeah, we'll go for that as well. There we go. I think that's a bow fully upgrade now as well. Nice. Okay, we ain't got much. We need to get some more grades for the shield though, but I think the axe and the bow are actually fully upgraded now. Very nice. Okay, let's continue on. Let's make our way to Jotunheim. Now we just need to figure out what door this key opens. It has to be somewhere around the temple. <laughs> I miss doing it. It's so cruel to kill the birds like this, but you know what? This is just a video game. I'm going to enjoy every minute of it. Come on, you can't deny though. It's so satisfying to do. Seeing the birds in the air just chucking the axe at them. Surely the birds must learn their lesson from many episodes ago that standing around here when Kratos is around is never a safe idea. Can I kill that bird there, or is he just going to fly off? Yep, he had, that bird has common sense not to stay around here when Kratos is here. Another name. Roger. Another Valkyrie. That's no coincidence. Oh, you're right. Now that we got the key, we can open that big door anytime we want. Let's explore. Yeah, but I'm trying to figure out... Oh. Which way do I go, though? Hang on. Do I go this way? I just hope I'm going the right way. To be fair, I think I'm going the right way. Well, I hope I'm going the right way. If I don't actually, no, I don't think I am going the right way. Hold on. No, I'm not going the right way. But I'll tell you what. I think I need to take the boat actually to go to where we need to go now. I think, by the looks of things. I got a little bit carried away by killing the birds. I wonder if I could kill him with the Blades of Chaos, though. Stand still. No. Ah. I was going to try and kill the bird, but no. So I think we need to go to the boat. Yes, I think it is the boat we need to go to. Oh, I missed that bird as well. The Blades of Chaos are definitely not as good for killing the birds. Maybe it's not the boat we need to take. If I just keep following the compass, we'll make our way to where we need to go. So the reality to getting to Jotunheim is almost in sight. Aha! This way we need to go. Tears rune. This is it. Place. Your guess is as good as mine, little brother. So now is with the realm travel room. We're beneath it. Why is the floor on the ceiling? Because we're underneath it. That's why. The ones above. So which way do I go? So I need to find a way. Oh, hold on. What's this? Up there. 
Fear used the same magic to protect the Black Rune. The clue we seek may be inside. Oh, right next to the Udenon door. Interesting. But can we reach it? Not from here. Sanctum within another. Those tapestries. Looks like more giant. Whatever it here did for them must have been big. I just have that feeling we are gonna have some enemies down here. I don't know why that is. I don't know if we will, but I just have that feeling we're gonna bump some enemies at some point. I'll just see what's around here quick. Is there anything around here? Or can we can we go any further than this? No. It just takes us back to the underneath the travel room. So if we head down here, we'll see what we need to do when we go around here. So I can't destroy that, it's a shame. Air discovered the Hall of Tear. Yeah. Boy, this is the room for your name. That's right. And look, we're on the other side of the door. The upside down door. What are you thinking? Stand back. Okay. He's gonna lift this up. What's moving? I know Kratos strong, but come on, surely this must be too heavy for Kratos. Extraordinary. The whole room is built on some kind of axle. There's chains on both sides. Without those, we can flip the temple. Oh, right. Do what now? Uh oh, things are happening. Okay, I don't think they're attacking. No, thankfully not. Imagine if we have to take on both of them at the same time. So what do I do here? Do I have to climb up one of these or something? Before the first, after the last. Nothing between, no shadow cast. Alpha. Are you quite sure flipping the temple is the only way to reach the whatever it is? You said there would be a path. The temple can be flipped. Therefore, we flip the temple. The logic is unassailable. Sure what happens when we recklessly upend a room that Where is this taking us? Realms. I'm curious, of course, but it's a leap to imagine it. Maybe when we go down here, we can break those chains. Well, who knows? Perhaps you and Tear are the same kind of mad. Yeah, Kratos is a madman. I don't think there's anyone in this world that is more mad than Kratos. Another one of these. Let's open it up. Here. Another one. It says his name is Bergomir. I think Mother said he was the king of the giants. Aye, that he was. And quite a bit more. Looks like he had a lot of kids. That, little brother, is what we call an understatement. He's dead, but nobody killed him. Do giants die from old age? They may, though it's rare among the Lightens. Okay, so I think there are two ways we can go. I think... I don't know where, when we go both ways. I don't know if they take us to the same area. If we need to go both ways, we'll do that. Oh. Come on, Mimir. We'll get through this. So, if I get that at the top, then maybe I'll stop it. We'll see what it does here. Do I have to line them all up or something? Hang on. Let's... Freeze this one here. We'll do it that way. So now I can get this one. I think if we can line them all up. To be honest with you, I didn't actually think this would work, but so far it's actually working a treat. Oh crap, did not mean to release it too early. 
I can't believe it's actually working to be honest. I didn't I actually didn't think this would work. Right, so now I just need to time it very carefully. Nah, come on me, you wouldn't want to miss this for the world. And typically the boy is going to have a little path to squeeze through, yep. Yeah, of course he does. If I was ahead like Mimir on Kratos' back going through traps, I'd probably be very scared as well. What do I do here? Hold on. Let's see what this does. Aha! That's done something. Oh, hold on. I'm thinking if I can take that wind out while it's down, it should lock that wheel into place. And it does that. Okay. I want to open this up quickly. I know there's going to be something hidden inside here. So we may as well go have a look while we're here. Heavy runic attack. Turns a blade of chaos towards enemy and on contact launch Kratos toward them to inflict large amount of stun damage. Nice. I could do it that. Open, opening up. That was worth it. It will close now, but I'm not going to need it, so I don't care if it closes. So I need to get this back into place. Hmm. Oh, no. Come on. There we are. And now they should all move. Eventually, at some point, we can make our way across. Just need to find the right time to do this. I think if I get hit by this once, I could well be dead. Oh, I thought I survived that. I thought I was going to survive that for a minute. Actually, I've got a better idea. If I take this wind out, I can then freeze. That one will stay up there. Then I can make my way through like that. Aha, that's a better idea. There we go. That was a better idea. I should have thought of that first time around. Hey, it's a fragment of a language session. You should look for more like So now I think I need to break these chains. Oh, ah, oh, one of these fire traps again. Is it, it going to start turning? Yes, it is turning. I knew at some point we were going to have some enemies in this room. I just had that feeling. Luck, I've got my Blades of Chaos upgraded now. All the way to level 4. Hopefully, by the end of this Let's Play, I can get upgraded to level 5. I hope so. I've got the, uh, the Lethian Axe upgraded to its maximum capability and... And with the bow as well. Hope I can get the Blades of Chaos upgrade to its maximum upgrades as well. I hope so. Oh no, we got a big guy too. As we'll deal with all the little enemies with no problem, this big guy had to show up. Well, I'll change Atreus' arrows. I think Atreus' shock arrows will do more damage to this guy, I think. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Oh. Get off me. Now would be a good time to use a rage, I think, actually. Put this guy out of his misery. Come on. There we are. That did it. Come here. 
kill them all. I'm hoping when I'm on top of this guy, hopefully these fire traps won't do any damage to me. No, it doesn't. Very nice. That is cool. Is he still alive? Yes, he is still alive. Okay, he's got much health. We can easily fish him off with the blades. There we are. Is he dropping anything? Oh, he's got some useful resources. Nice. I'll definitely pick it all up. Yeah, out of it. It is over. So now what do I do? Go this way now, maybe? No. So now I need to know where I need to go now. Down here or something? Or do I have to make my way back now? I like music playing around here at the minute, though. It's the sort of music you play when Kratos and Atreus are in some sort of Pow. Yeah, it looks like we do have to go back this way. Seeing these enemies spawn, I think, is giving a bit of an idea that we do need to go back this way. How did the wheel not hit me then? I must have been inches away from it hitting me. Oh, another... Ugh. Another remaining tool. We've got three fire holes to deal with now as well. Hey, okay, not a problem. We could deal with all these guys while we're here. Get some more useful resources. I don't think I really need to bother dealing with these guys, but I'm going to because obviously I do not want them following me while I'm trying to get past them traps. So I think we'll deal with these guys just to be on the safe side. Come here. Well, these guys are much tougher enemies than we dealt with in the previous room. Oh. Ah. Well, I'll go this side and take him out this way. Oh. Oh, I actually managed to, I managed to deflect that. I thought that attack was going to be too heavy for Kratos to, um, to block, but it actually wasn't. When I pressed the block button when he was about to swing, I thought, oh no, bad idea. But it wasn't. It's funny, I thought his attacks, I thought those kind of attacks would be stronger than that. The other chain waits. Whoa, that was close. I literally just run ahead there, didn't even think twice about it. <laughs> okay, now I think we need to go this way, I think. Ah, uh, yes. Don't worry, we can deal with these, this army. This army ain't got nothing on us. I remember this puzzle, actually. So I need to find the right time to swing the axe. Actually, hold on. Now release that. Now they should... Yep, yeah, there we are. There we go. Now if I freeze the middle one into place, this middle one will not come down. There we are, we were across. Just like that. Oh, there's a chest here. Bratus of the World Serpent, legendary wrist arm, magic masterfully created offensive armor favoring runic. Fair enough, I'll take that. Ah, looks like we can break the floor beneath us. I know. I know you do. Don't worry, Mimir, you'll be fine. Well, I want to think about this a bit carefully, because I do not want this killing me. Hmm. Actually, I think I probably want to get on top of this one. Hopefully this doesn't kill me. No. So I wonder how I get across. Oh, don't do that! Oh, actually, hang on. I did not mean to swing the axe like that, and it actually got me across. Wow. I've got a really sensitive R2 button on my PS5 controller. All it takes is just a little tap, and Kratos... Yeah, we'll just swing the axe. 
in any game, if I press the R2 button, it will shoot the gun very... Yeah, my R2 button on my controller is definitely more sensitive than the L2 button. I think it just shows how much I use the R2 button, especially when I'm playing first-person shooters. So that's the second one. So now we need to go back and flip that temple. Whoa! I didn't see this thing. I didn't think this would come back. Oh no. We got these on. I like the Dark Soul, Demon Soul looking enemies. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Not a good start. Oh my god. Good job there's some health pickups around here. Oh, right here, I'll just pick this up. There we are. Ouch. I did not see that, I didn't think that was coming. I'm gonna get away from there, well. Come on, boy, I'm gonna need you to start using some arrows here. Whoa. That was close. I don't think I'm going to survive this. I should have saved my rage for these guys. But no, I didn't do that. I should have thought about, I should really should have thought about this, using the rage at this point. I'm ashamed I can't do that. Almost. Well, I'm ashamed the guy's got a shield behind him. At least he's not actually using the shield properly at the minute. Ow. Ouch. Hopefully we won't kill one of these guys. Hopefully one of them will drop some health. The arrows are doing quite a bit of damage to them. Aha. Perfect. Oh, they didn't drop any health. That's a shame. Uh-oh. I had no idea what that guy was doing for a minute. It's good if I brought that resurrection stone earlier. Good job I've got Atreus here to help me out. Leave my boy alone. Uh oh. Come on, I can't let him kill me now. No way. What the? I know, I can see that. Let's just get out of... Whoa! Oh, so how am I going to get across here now? Luckily there's some health on the other side, which is good. So I need to find a way to get across. Well, I could just let them go in the traps here and just let them kill themselves. Yeah, that would be a good idea. I guess I could just run across. Which I am going to do, actually. Not screw I can't hang around here. I had to pick up the health there. I had to risk it then because I'm way too low on health. Die! Get out of here! Do I really have to worry about these guys? Gonna run for it. There we are. Hopefully they won't come chasing after us. Well, if they do, they'll go in, in them traps anyway, so I don't think it really matters. Okay, now then, I need to go back and lift that bridge. Trace, where are you? I was hoping I wasn't to go back there, then, because if I did, I'll have to go back through them traps again, just to get to Atreus. But in case this doesn't work, just remember, Tyr had good cause to create these obstacles. He's kept Jotunheim out of Odin's reach, but the world is hardly at peace. No, but it's got hope. We're all working together now. We have unity. That's what the rune on the door to this place was telling us. We're on Tyr's back. 
Okay, let's lift this up. Hopefully it'll work this time. If that doesn't convince Kratos is a strong man, I don't know what will. Quite happy to be on your side, brother. And we're not dead. That's a plus. There, on the left. I think we can climb back up to the round shaft from there. Yep, I've got a very sensitive R R2 button on my controller. So what do oh, I have to climb up now. See that Mimir? Nobody could do all this alone. All these obstacles. They're just chances to prove we're the ones who can beat them. We may argue. Me and father, you and Freya, Brock and Sindri. But when we all work together, we do make a good team. And that's Tyr's test. That's why we're going to make it the Odin home. Do you hear that, brother? Let's find this equilibrium. What's that? It means you speak wisely, Atreus. And that is good to hear. Hopefully they're saying some kind of death trap. I don't think it will be. Let's go have a look at it, though. Hmm. Ah. Oh, boy, come over here. Boy, your knife. What have we got? Some sort of travel stone. Let me see. Great our dumbless of us. That's the Unity Stone. You know it. I wasn't sure it existed. If Tyr possessed this, that explains how he could visit all the realms and other lands to boot. He held this. In the panel at Odin's library. Yes, that's it. I understand now. It shows Tyr walking the realm between realms. You know how he must never stray from the path. Well, Tyr always followed his own path, if you catch my meaning. The realm between realms. Complete a path to Jotunheim. So now... We've now got that stone. So now we can explore the realm between realms. I think we'll save this off for the next episode. And you're thinking to reach the secret path to Yodanheim, that's what we need to do? I am. Oh dear. That is what you're thinking, isn't it? So I think we'll continue this off for the next episode and we'll get to Yotunhelm hopefully in the next episode if possible. Okay guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe and keep updated with all the War episodes that to my channel. And next episode, hopefully, we'll finally get to Jotunheim. Hope to see you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching. This is GoldieX and I'm out.